In the Bit Commander, each folder is represented as a tab in a vertical list. Folder hierarchy is presented as a system of nested tabs on different levels to make it clearly visible. Clicking on a folder, its child folders are revealed by sliding all ancestor folder levels to the left. This way you always look at the same area until you find your desired folder. If you use touchscreen, you won't even need to move the hand while navigating. All folder levels remain visible by automatically resizing them to fit available space. If they become too narrow, hover any of them with a cursor to expand. If a folder name doesn't fit available space, it will be displayed shortened using an intelligent algorithm. Folders and files are separated and independently scrollable, so you always have the full window height for files. Files are presented in a much more human-friendly way than in other file managers. File names are shown without special characters, and words are separated to improve readability. Numbers are thicker, so you can find the revision you want faster. If a file name is too long, it is intelligently shortened to fit available space while keeping it recognizable. Instead of file's absolute date, you will see much more useful relative date called file age. If file was modified less than 24 hours ago, you will see how many hours and minutes ago the file was modified. If the file was modified less than 2 months ago, you will see how many days passed. Up to a year ago, you will see file age in number of months. Color coding of the file age makes it even easier to find what you are looking for. The older the file, the colder the color. If you still need absolute date, just hover cursor over the date. If you don't recognize file icon, hover it to see the extension. While I was using Windows Explorer, I have found that I had to switch between detailed view and thumbnails very often, so I decided to combine both in a separate view. In this special view, image files are displayed as thumbnails while all other files are listed with details. To make most use of the space, all thumbnails have fixed height while their width is proportionally resized. This is perfect for folders containing pictures with varying aspect ratios, even once mixing portrait-oriented images and white panoramas. You can easily create to-do tasks in any folder. These are basically text files with custom extension, which program recognizes and styles differently. There is also a special to-do folder you can use to organize yourself. If you point it to your Dropbox folder, you will have it synchronized across all your computers. Instead of using Windows Start button, use Programs folder for convenient access to installed programs. You can open multiple file browser tabs within the same window and easily switch between them. All buttons are context sensitive, which means that each button is visible only if it's clickable. Selecting a file or folder enables appropriate buttons. You can copy and move files in several ways. The easiest is just drag them to another folder, drive, different tab, or add them to temporary list. Think of temporary list as a better clipboard, because you can collect all the files there before copying them. The other way of copying files is clicking copy to button. This opens another tab where you can navigate to desired folder and press OK button. If you used the desired destination before, you can just select it from the recent destinations list. This is useful when you're sorting files between multiple folders. When you press OK button, files are ready to a batch worker and you're back to the source folder. Batch worker is a module for sequential file operations. Since it processes files one by one, it makes the copying faster. It does not interrupt for errors, but lets you decide about those at later time. Batch worker is also useful for maintaining multiple backups since you can save the whole list and run it at different times. You can even export the list as Windows batch file and make it execute every time you log off your computer.